I'm here because I am a roaring lion crying out righteousness. When Job, who was a very, very, very trusted man of God, was attacked by the devil, and he didn't know why he was being attacked, but the devil said that he told God, he was up there in heaven. If you told God, he says, I've been throughout all the earth, and I can do what I want to do down there. God said, no, you can't. And the devil said, yes, I can. And the devil said, what about your servant, Job? But God said, what about him? And so Job, the devil attacked Job and took his health, took his wealth, took his family, actually took his wife, took his friends, took his name, took his title, and then sat him down on an ash heap or a sheep. Let me say this parenthetically, while I believe that we are a blessed people here at Atla. I have to tell you that because we are so blessed and because we do honor the Lord and because we are purposed to, uh, to, to prepare a place for Jesus to return to. Now, you don't have to believe that. You don't have to believe that. Please don't fall out with me if you don't believe that. He's going to come back somewhere. When he comes back, you do believe he's coming back, Right. So he's going to come back somewhere. So am I, is it sin for me to believe when he comes back? He's coming back to Allah. Is it a sin? So, but you don't have to fall out with me. But here's what I want to say. You know, Job was attacked because he honored God. He trusted the Lord. And I believe that the Lord, the foreclosure that we're going through, is an attack, and I'll be I'll give more details about that. But I believe some of the sicknesses that we are experiencing in our in our church is an attack because of our righteousness. And I, and I want everybody who may be experiencing um, infirmities or some sort of sickness, some sort of loss of income, loss. Of um, I, um, I believe it's because we're so beloved of God that the devil is attacking. He, he can't take me down. He can't stop me from preaching, can't stop me from crying righteousness. The courts have not been able to actually finally, uh, the, 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 the LGBTQ plus queers have not been actually able to take the building. It's, I'm still in the fight. The fight is still going on. But we are experiencing a few sicknesses in our, in our body, in our, our church body, I mean. And I believe that it's an attack. The same way Job was attacked, I believe it's an attack by the devil to try to discourage us, to try to take us down. And I, I just want to say this to the devil. I just want to say that devil caused sickness. To the devil that's called sickness. One of our captains had to uh, rush his wife to the medical facility yesterday in the middle of the day. And uh, we uh, are sending our prayers out for Matron Rainbow Farr and others. But I want to say to that devil called sickness, devil, I want to talk to you. I, I got a word for you. Well, I got four words for you. Jesus is a healer. Now, I want you to put that in your tail and wag that around for a while, devil. I want to talk to that sickness devil. Mr. Sickness devil, Mr. Sickness devil, I know who you are. I've seen you before. I've seen you. I know who you are. You've tried to take a lot of people down, Mr. Sickness devil. I know you. I know you. Uh, I've seen you. I've seen that poverty devil. I've seen all of y'all. I know all y'all devils. I know all of y'all. All of y'all devils. I even met your king devil named King Totally Good Joseph. I met him too. I know him. But I want to say to that sickness devil, I want to say this, something to you. Jesus is a healer. And uh, we, you know, Job, 
Mr. Sickness Devil, can I, I'm going to read the Bible to you. I call that, I'm going to whoop your tail. I'm going to whoop your behind with the word of God. I'm going to whoop your behind with devil, you sickness devil. I'm going to whoop your behind with the word of God. So here. You know, Job was attacked because he was a good man. Job was attacked because he was a righteous man. And the Bible said he eschewed evil. The devil attacked him. Took everything. Took his name, took his health, took his wife for a while. Took his children. Took everything. But you, you, you devil, you devil, you, listen. See, Job was an upright man. He was a righteous man, there's no doubt about it. And God blessed him. One of the most blessed man, one of the most blessed man on planet Earth, just like I declare I'm one of the most blessed men on planet Earth right this moment as I speak. But the devil attacked. And I want to say this, that Job didn't have the narrative or the event of Job. Job couldn't turn into the Bible. Job couldn't open up the Bible and say, well, this kind of thing has happened before me, so my faith will be, my faith will be, in, in, will be insured and doubled down because I saw another Job. I saw someone else come through the same thing I'm coming through. But devil, we got Job. See, we're not the first to go through this. No, we're not the first to be attacked like this. We're not the first to be attacked like this. You sickness devil, you sickness devil, you, you rotten stinking sickness, you rotten devil, you. We got, we, we got the book of Job to look at. We, we have an advantage over Job. So you know we coming through. And guess what, devil? <laughs> God restored to Job twice as much as he lost. <laughs> so you the fool around picked on the wrong person. And I can tell you this, Mr. Sickness Devil, that we also have stepped in Solomon's space. That's right. We have stepped into Solomon's space by the power of this word that God has given to us in, 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 in Proverbs. And our teaching has come up as a memorial before Almighty God. God looked down. You know, Brother Schofield, you know, edited the entire Bible. And uh, a few others have done similar but uh, we have probably, we have, we have won or we have memorialized chapter three of the book of Proverbs more so than any other, even Schofield, as diligent and thorough as his work was with the word of God. And it was, it is thorough. Schofield Bible is still one of the best you can get. But our, but he didn't spend as much time on Proverbs as we have done. And so it's come up as a memorial before Almighty God, Mr. Devil, Mr. Devil. So I, I, I thought I would say that, and I want to tell everybody we're coming out of this. We, we, we're coming out of this. No, we're coming out. And, you know, it's because we're so upright before God. You know, he's taking away our children. You know, he, he did that to us. He did it. You know, he did it. Everybody knows he did that to us. Took our children away from us, the devil did. Yeah, he did. Just like he did Job. Just like he did Job. Just like he did Job. Now he tried to take our property. Just like he did Job. Just like he did Job. Just like he did Job. But you know what Job said? What's it Job chapter 3, verse 15? Job said, though he slay me, yet will I trust him. The devil didn't know what to do with that. He didn't know what on earth to do with that. He, he, knew, he, he knew that he couldn't handle that. That way he had met his match. But he knew he met his match. But we're going to keep on being a shining light, preaching the word of God. Now, so I wanted to say that about the attack that's happening and, 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 and send a word to the sickness devil that uh, Jesus is a healer. 
And I'm the Lord's servant. I, I thought I told you that before, devil. I thought I told you that. I thought I told you, devil. That hate devil. We'll, we'll talk to you a little bit later on. That hate devil. I'll talk to you all. Too. No, we'll, we'll talk to you too. But I wanted to deal with that sick devil. And I've been fighting that. I, we just hired a new lawyer this morning. Haven't gotten rid of any of the old ones, but our, our fight has become so broad, we had to hire a new lawyer this morning. I just sent the retainer a big, fat payment to him. The, uh, so that, uh, that property devil that took all Joe's property, well, I got news for you. We, we're still fighting. And that's, 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 that's all. It's just an attack. That's all it is. It's just an attack. Let's go to the Lord in prayer. Heavenly Father, we thank you. We praise you. We thank you for stepping into Solomon, allowing us to step into Solomon's dream. And we thank you for the privilege to become co-laborers with the great prophet of Job. Great, good God Almighty. We're co-laborers, all of us, one and all, from the youngest person from the, who's the youngest? Emerald, 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 Emerald. From Emerald to Mother Shekinah and everybody in between. We're, we're co-workers with Job. We're, we're co-workers with the upright. We're co-workers with righteousness. We're co when we thank you, Almighty God, we thank you, Lord Jesus. We praise your name for choosing us to suffer for your sake, for choosing us to be a witness at this time, for choosing us. You chose us, and for that we're grateful. And we give your name the glory and the honor. Hallelujah and amen. All right, so now.